Mild weather this winter and spring might mean you need to keep an eye on your pets this spring. Some vets are noticing more cats and dogs are coming in with fleas as of late. That's why News 10's Matt Brooks went to the Pet Care Animal Hospital in Terre Haute to find out what you can do to keep fleas away from you and your pets. You might enjoy the relatively mild months we've had so far this year, but so are the fleas. Staff at the Pet Care Animal Hospital have noticed a major increase in the local flea activity. I was shopping the other day and I actually had a giant flea jump on me at Walmart, so... I mean, if it's at Walmart, it's everywhere. It's not so much that the flea populations have increased, but they just never died off. We never really got rid of fleas this winter. It was just way too mild of a season. So fleas have been a problem throughout the winter and they're only going to get worse. That's why Dr. Shank recommends treating every nook of your home for fleas now rather than later. It's kind of a war with all these little battles that we fight, hoping to get, you know, a good front on this flea control. Um, you can't just do one thing without addressing the other or you'll never really eradicate them. Before using any treatment in your home or flea preventative on your pets, you'll need to consult with an expert first. I would have your pet examined, take them to the veterinarian, because a lot of our flea products are species specific. You want to make sure if you have a cat, you use something appropriately for cats. Same with dogs. They don't cross over. You can't use a dog product on a cat. And it goes, a lot of them go by weight. If you find that you still have fleas around the home after following the advice of your veterinarian, you may need to contact a pest control company. In Terre Haute with photojournalist John Tim, Matt Brooks, News 10. When using any flea preventative treatment in your home, make sure you follow the directions exactly so you keep your pets and kids safe.